must say. Hi. Thank you. That is a warm welcome. Guys, he smells really good. I must say, it's nice to meet you, Jimmy. You look very different on TV. Thank you. Thank you. I've had a little work done. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you got a good surgeon. Thank you. <laughs> um, it's great that you're here. Did you see the prom proposal we just did? I did. Wasn't very that sweet. Cute? Congratulations. So cute. Did you go to your prom? I feel like you would definitely have gone to a lot of proms. You know, in England, you don't have proms, but we would have uh, the occasional school disco. Which sounds very 80s. Funky. So. Yeah. Wow. Pretty funky. Uh, and I only went to one because it was the greatest uh, two weeks of my life leading into the worst day of my life. The most popular girl in our school, Rachel Gould, who I had an enormous crush on. Okay. Everybody had an enormous crush on. I was 13. Uh, so was she. And she asked me to be her prom date or her school disco date. And two weeks before. And so I just was made up. I was on cloud nine. Yeah. And, uh, you know, was sort of planning the rest of our lives and, you know, <laughs> children's names and such. And then the day before, she told me she was only joking. Oh. And she went with Sebastian Lipiat instead. Can I and everybody knew. Like, we were like royalty at that point in school. Everyone knew that we were going together, so then I couldn't go and ask someone else, so I had to go by myself. And my mom <laughs> said, do you want me to come with you? <laughs> I said, mom, no, no, mom. you can't. That makes mom, it they... worse. Can it I just really... say one thing? F you, Rachel Gould. <laughs> to her a few years Did ago you? and, and uh, I reminded her of this and she she didn't remember and she said I'm so sorry I'm so sorry yeah She's too little dirty. too late Rich. yeah that's right <laughs> if only she could see you now now that I'm okay uh, let's do one more one more one more here we go here we go hello hi am. hi what's your name my name's Sebastian Sebastian yeah. and where are you from I'm from Newcastle Newcastle okay do you live there or here uh, I live in Newcastle yeah okay all right off you go with the story Sebastian well, uh, many moons ago, um, uh, I actually went to school in Newcastle, um, and there was a disco coming up. Uh, there was a really popular girl at school. Um, the usual sort of scenario, all the, all the, you know, all the guys after her. Um, I sort of waited to the last moment, last couple of days, um, and asked a girl, one of this popular girl, in question, if she'd like to go with me. She said yes. This was literally, the, I think, the day before the disco. Um, uh, lo and behold, the, it turns out that she was actually going to go with somebody else. Um, and that other person was actually Charlie. Sebastian Lipiat! That's the one, man. Sebastian Lipiat! I didn't know! <laughs> I was How could this have happened to two people? <laughs> Rachel Gould! <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're, they're very same, yes, you know who it is. Wow. You know, at the time... You look older at, than at me. The time, I was very <laughs> awesome. That's the same age. Same age. <laughs> <laughs> and did you end up marrying Rachel Gould? Uh, no, not yet, no. Not okay. Yet. <laughs> there's still time. Right, well, you, know, you don't happen to have a sword with you, do you? <laughs> uh, you, you, could, you could have revenge if you want to. Do you want to? There you go. Um, well done, everyone. If you'd like to join us on the show and have a go in the red chair, you can contact us via our website at this very address. And that is it for tonight. Please say a huge thank you to my guests, Amelda May, Jason Manford, Billy Piper, Guy Ritchie, and Charlie Hum. Join me next week with musical guest Cheryl Crow. Dr. Alan Cumming, singing star Keith Urban, and Oscar winner Nicole Kidman. I'll see you then. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. <laughs>